the first to know in SMP TV. Yeah, Mama Kwaba, Eba and SMP TV. SMP be the first to know. I have been treated unfairly. We and Samoa, NDC MP, our Memphis Central, Eka, Ninina, and say he has break away from NDC party to run as end independence. No, we better say add the NT and a Peter Yaukwachi, Eka, our NDC MP, at me a break away, sir. Or you're the member of parliament, or the incumbent member of parliament for a Memphis Central. Now, the Yakoba and I said, I draw NDC for called primaries, I were Memphis Central. No, in fact, there was a third candidate, a second candidate, a friend of Joanna Jain Kujo. Ah, or you're Kwachi Aka, Peter Yao Kwachi Aka, and open it. Now, the Amana Yen, yeah. Na oko independent and it's a nomination form one NDC for selling out to parliamentary candidates na a year forty five thousand Ghana cities. Na bushia for a re who's someone the woman is a kwache aka pita ya kwache aka we incumbent MP eight years a KB say oko contested for the seat of MP Ewa Memphi. Central. Now the Okoba and say NDC for at the Joanna Jain Kujo at the Kleno as unopposed candidate at Jesse. On the sideline, a year Kwachi Aka said one of the went to contest for elections in Nibi. Now Yanko feed news dot com. Now Yanko can kind in Sem Nibi or say. Despite paying the mandatory nomination fee to contest the NDC's primary in a Memphis Central, my opponent, Joanna Jankujo, was declared the unopposed candidate, leaving him sidelined. He felt his move was highly unfair and expressed his disapproval of how the situation was handled. I've been treated unfairly. If the party intends to rerun the primary, they should give everyone a half chance, a fair chance. They took my nomination fee of 45,000 Ghana cities only to declare my opponent on a post. That's unacceptable. If the people want me, I will stand as an independent. Kwachi Aka stated, I will have an interview also between Ono and City FM. And now, what they His decision to contest as independent candidate has drawn attention especially in light of his opposition as the sitting MP despite the risk involved in breaking away from the NDC Kwachi Aka remains focused on his goal emphasizing that his primary concern is the way of the people of Amenfi Central he is confident that his constituents will Continue to support him even if he is no longer running on the party ticket. Now, we will cast away a risk case here would take a one alive for more. Now, a bab one idea no say more say. A dear NDC, dear Yanon, or cast away to me, dear Chom one up, or NNT, and now many because they were breaking from NDC or contesting for NDC independent candidates. Say or no, on contested. On the seed of NDC, na obere ni aba, ana amam phone hi ana on phone kura, on phone, on phone kura. Kwachi Aka is not alone in this move. Two other incumbent MPs from the New Patriotic Party (NPP), Cynthia Mamle Morrison of Agona West, Kwajo Asante of Suhum, have also chosen to rerun as independents in the December 2024 elections. Another notable case is Andrew Asiyama Amwaku, the current deputy speaker of Palmer, who, after serving as an independent MP for Palmer, has now filed to contest on the MPP ticket. Now, sa breaking away, breaking away, and yet, Kwachi Akam Kwan and Ato, now about MPP Munsua, two MPP parliamentary candidates, Aya Cynthia Morrison, caught with the injunction tone of the only thing who was doing himself. As an independent candidate, I know Kwajo Asante, I was whom, and also Sir 
I break it for MP, MPP to also contest as independent candidate. Afe Andrew Asiyama Marko, ah, or your second deputy speaker of parliament, I didn't know him, sir. Oh no, Emma Oboa, Emma MPP, it's me, Enya, majority in parliament, in the eighth parliament. And uh, on also a breaking away from independent to contest on the ticket of MPP. She said, and no one some at my sparky a war a parliament. I am commotion a cosso every now and then. I'm a minority cry to my file to speak as a one declare for four seats, you know, on the of on the ticket of MPP no vacant send a bear minority a bit many majority our parliament so the growing trend of MPs going independent has sparked debates with how Idrisu, the MP for Tamale calling for the speaker of parliament to declare their seat vacant he argues that these MPs have essentially cross party lines by running as independents despite this Kwachiaka is undeterred. He insists that his decision to go independent is driven by a desire to serve his people fairly, adding that he would rather stand alone than continue under what he believes is the unjust system. Or say, or no, a year pass, and I will only say a year above one or say, or no, who are the contest as an independent candidate, than so or then who be joining NDC at the Oma treating no unfairly. Obia ono oye incumbent MP on the seat of NDC. Na NDC yet me treating it in that manner. Ono say the political career will lose crowns of contest. On to me contest on the seat of NDC na. But you so happy about it. Na I just said same day. Wa bro so be ba 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 ba. Na in fact, and someone air quarter na buja for. Ningina is stemming from the unjust system allegedly no NDC party no a woman. In fact, a as a film ye say incumbent MP on the seat of NDC pa ah mose you are taking away NPP administration from power na maba na incumbent MP our notice or no. Mu mo mo san ko declare ni opponent Joanna Kujo say onko ono post me wa he has sacrificed so much in opposition as an MP for NDC party though they were in opposition now no and also say unfair treatment as a general 45000 Ghana cedis at the appeal to ningi na ma ma no an contest the crowd na we ka say aba and your two ya went to me and rain it. And you will say a very unfair. And you will be to me as a source of empty or no. Or when you say, say, or contest as independent, a ye, a ye, change say, or they need to get a bit more NDC. Now, I wish I for someone. Echo so, and I did a bit more.